Hey, hey everyone, Angela O'Hare here, your favorite Las Vegas realtor. And today I'm over here at Highline by Lennar Homes in the Red Point Square Village doing a tour of these townhomes. Not sure about much of the pricing just yet. I will leave all that in the comments down below. How Lennar is, you do your own self-guided tour and you figure it all out as you go. But this one is the Dew Drop and it's 1760 square feet with three bedrooms and two and a half baths and a two car garage. Looks like this is probably the only type of yard that you're gonna have. The Dew Drop is in the middle. Then you have the sunlight and then the Marigold, I do believe they're all interesting names. So let's go walk into this one. This has a very nice feel to it. I like it. It's very open. Doesn't feel tight. Feels pretty good. Now when you buy Lennar, I don't know if you guys are familiar with Lennar, you have, they have the everything included package. So like those blinds are gonna come with the home. Those are standard kitchen cabinets. Um, this is probably the quartz countertops that comes with the home as well. So you don't have to spend a lot of money with Lennar like a lot of the other builders because a lot of these things come with the home. Now, the only thing is, is when you do buy new construction regardless of builder, the only areas that's going to come tiled is the kitchen, the entry, and the bathrooms and laundry, all the wet areas. When I buy, if I ever bought new construction, my advice to you is... Don't put carpet. Spend the extra money on the flooring at least. If that's the only upgrade you're gonna do, then upgrade the flooring, okay? That's the best advice I can give you guys because it's harder to sell homes with carpets. People, we live in the desert. People don't wanna have a home with a carpet. So this is a very, very good size island. The cabinets look like they're a dark espresso color with the shaker, or they could be black. Um, and again, these cabinets come with the house. I think there could be three color options. I do believe black, white, and gray. Looks like these are upgraded appliances. I could be wrong. They're the G monogram. And I'm not sure if the refrigerator, washer, and dryer comes with the home. But from the few, 10 Lennar homes I sold last year, um... I think some of them did come with it. This one has a half bath downstairs and then a nice storage area that's under the stairs. Garage entry door open. And then, oh, look at all the doors are being stored here. The garage, tankless water heater, and then it's also plumbed for a water softener. Okay, left to right, let's go here. Wow, this is actually a very good size room. Looks like a queen size bed. <sighs> I'm out of shape. With a full size dresser, a nice walk-in closet, very good size. Oh, cute. These rooms feel very good. This has your cultured marble. And I think these are the floors that come with the home. So this is your standard builder grade options. 
and the standard builder grade insert for the second bathtub. Now, the nice thing with Lennar is a lot of these things come included, so you're not spending extra money on a lot of upgrades. Then the laundry room with the smart panel. Then we're going into the primary. This is a very good size primary. It's very big. It's a nice combo. I like that. I mean, I know it's builder grade, but it's still very nice looking. Again, they went with the cultured marble and then the shaker, black shaker cabinets, your separate John area, then a decent size walk-in closet. This space feels very good, even at 1,700 square feet. I like it. Um, it doesn't feel like that I'm in a townhome with two other houses next in between me. <coughs> Sorry, guys. It's very good. So I will leave down in the comments below or the description below the price, all the HOA information, and any other information that's pertinent to this community. But if you're thinking about buying new construction in the Summerlin area, I am your local Summerlin expert. I sell a lot of new construction and resell homes here in Summerlin. You can always give me a call at 702-370-5112. As always, make sure you like, share, and subscribe, guys. I'll see you on the next one.